Hello and welcome to the Magic World Review Show. This is week um, gazillion plus two. Plus two. Yes, I'm James Anthony from Magic World, and this is Daniel Meadows from this world. From this world. You know, from Magic World. No. Oh man, but you're in Magic World. I am. That's what it's all about. We are here to review two products this week. We are here to review Touch by Eric LeBlanc. Chin. <laughs> Chin by Eric LeBlanc. <laughs> yep. <Yeah>. Chin. <laughs> Sorry about that. I just find it hard to... You could be touching. I could have said it like that. You did say that last time. Before we started this, that's how he pronounced it. And I was going to let him go with his uh, Tarantula and uh, David Regal. Uh, well, let's, that's 36 99 And we're gonna, also going to be reviewing Canic. So, borrow any can. Uh, Canic by Nicholas Lawrence. And that one is the 23 99 They're the two products for this week. Coming up. Let's get going, but go. Just very quickly, let's cut to a word from our sponsors. This week's show is sponsored by PrintByMagic.com. We print directly to your bicycle playing cards. Okay, that was a word from our uh, sponsors, Print by Magic, because they do print bicycle playing cards directly onto the surface, and it is incredible quality. Some of the best, best magic companies around the world are ordering from us. It's false so, advertising, though, isn't it? What? You do the printing. It's not done by magic. No, no. What? <laughs> it is done it's, by it's magic. Not it's not done by fairies and elves. It's just a in case. magical process I don't, I don't is what we use. I don't want to let you into like trade secrets, but it's not like a little gnome sat in How the How cool would that be, though? That would be awesome. <laughs> well, there we go. Anyway, moving on, moving on. Uh, <clears throat> let's start off with... Chin. I'm glad you pronounced chin. that correctly. Chin! As a chin. There we go. Um, Eric LeBlanc. First thing I'll say, cheesy. Extremely cheesy. Pot kettle and black. <laughs> Are we going to show the trailer? Show what? The trailer. Yeah, let's cut to the trailer. Now! And we are back. Um, so I hope you enjoyed that trailer. Yes. It's quite good fun. Um, first of all, we've got a few thoughts about this. He goes into a lot of detail about different productions, different changes, different things. Just to clarify detail, so there's no talking. What there is, is like miming yep. of how to hold things. And you go, it'll go over it. It's like David time. Stone. David Stone, so it's, it's multi-language. Yep. There's no language. You're off the camera there on that side. Move in a bit. Well, stop pushing me off. Sorry. <laughs> um, so you, you'll mime exactly how you've got to hold it, yep. how you've got to have things yep. set up. Yep. Now, important, there are 11 things taught, okay? Only two of them can you do, of the 11, two of 11 can you do with the gimmick provided. All the others require yep. a top it, sleeves, or you to be sat down. Yep. So ultimately what you do get out of the two, you can do the one with the straw, which is a bit like David Stone, and you can do the splash bottle yep. type one. And I'll be right in saying that it does not say anywhere that you need to have a top it. In I, the advertising online? I couldn't find it anywhere, and I think that is important. So Did just, you, you read the description, didn't you? Yeah, as well? I've, I've read the, it. On, I, I, I've thing. not found it. I've read it on the back. I've, I've not found it. It mentions doesn't mention about that the you need it. to have a top Now, it. It, I think it's just to be pointed out, because you may be thinking that what you're getting with a DVD and gimmick-wise is going to allow you to do everything you see. Yep. It's half of the system he uses. Yep. So... For some people, it's easier to describe it in terms of what's already out yep. there. You've got Splash Bottle is already out there. The advantage of this is it's customisable, yep. so you could use glasses of liquid and other things, yep. and it gives you a nice way of 
making things vanish for yep. the liquid, but you need the other half of the system. Yeah. Okay, so and he's, he's got some nice productions, uh, some nice ideas with the balloon production and lots of other things on here. A long DVD shows you how to do a lot of the items. Um, extremely cheesy music from start to finish. I mean, I just literally this circusy kind of like... It's like that. And I'm like... Just get on with it. <laughs> it's his character. But apart from that, uh, you do learn a lot of good things. It teaches you how to do them step by step. Um, the biggest fault I found, and it's not really a fault, I think if you buy this, be prepared. You might have to do some fixing. Uh, the reason being, you get a gimmick with it. Um, and I'm sure that you might be aware of other gimmicks on the market. There's a splash bottle and other things available. Now... If you're going to be producing a bottle of wine and something heavier, I potentially would use the um, still go for the splash bottle option. Or if you're using this, my only gripe with it, I would, the item, I would reinforce it. Is, is how we'll say it. As all we we'll say is, as you're a qualified seamstress. Every after. now and again, there's stitching. We we made 150 springy snakes once. <laughs> but all I say is, the part that goes, uh, there's to do with the, the belt, gimmick. the, the gimmick. belt and the gimmick and the loop. And it's just simply not stitched in strong enough. It's one little row of stitches, and it's nowhere near strong enough to withstand constant everyday use. It will break easily. I'm 99% sure of that. So all I'd say is, it's very easy to fix. You just need to give it a good double stitching. Someone will do it, boom, if it were to go at the worst case scenario. But apart from that, the rest of it, it's well thought out. It works well. well. He uses it because you can see his exactly. Plays, uh, Dan's exactly. side. He gives you and he's very like good a, on a talent show. He looks yeah. like he's performing on a talent show for judges <laughs> and the camera. Yeah, yeah. Um, so he does use yeah. it. It's more of like an opener sort of effect. He yeah. gives credits where credits are, are due as going through each yeah. one of the eleven items. So Some things are just there for inspiration. Yeah. That he doesn't teach. But of the eleven items, with nothing else, you could only do two of them. So yeah. I just wanted to reiterate that you can do the one with the straw. He'll show yeah. you the one with the straw, and you can do the balloon one. Yeah, um, they're the only ones you're going to be able to do unless you've got other stuff. Yeah, so brilliant. Okay, so let's uh, first of all, I'm not even going to say touching again. Chin, chin, chin. It's like cheers. I know, chin. It's 36.99. Let's give it a rating out of 10. Um, although I say and I mock its cheesiness, uh, it certainly is high up there. I think you're going to learn a lot from this. You're going to have to still go out and get certain things, perhaps jackets all to do things, uh, but it comes with one of the gimmicks anyway, and uh, I would give this a clear... I'm actually going to go up to a 9, because it's teaching you how to do 11... Is it 11 or 13? It's 11. 11 crazy effects. You're literally changing... One minute you're changing liquid to another while just passing it behind your back. You're pulling liquid out of your... Jacket, an empty glass, one minute it goes out of your jacket and the next minute it's full. You're not going to do all of them. No. Just, just to make sure people are aware of that, you, you can't sequence them yep. necessarily. Yes. But you just an, do one. As an opener for a stand up yeah, piece, yeah. a lot of people rely on the splash yep. bottle type gimmick. Uh, this gives you other options and there yep. are another bit for making um, glasses of liquid disappear was very, very nice. Exactly. So he teaches it well. Yes, it's cheesy music, but I'm not going to knock any points off for that. <laughs> you loved it. <laughs> I loved it. Uh, so, yeah, definitely a nine for me. What do you think? Are you happy with a nine? What were you going to give it? Uh, I probably would have gone eight. So eight? If, so, yeah, yeah. yeah. If, yeah. If, if, if that's what you're after for stand-up magic, I don't necessarily think it's your walk-around sort of piece. Um, but no. for stand-up magic and you want to do something with liquids, you'll get quite a lot of inspiration yeah. from there. You could easily do it walk-around. I mean, I've got a topic walk-around jacket for certain things, but not if I have to carry lots of things in my pockets. So... Just it does work. Just that, bearing in mind, some of them you're not going to do surrounded when yep. you're turning around, those sort of ones, just, yep. just if you hadn't worked that bit out. Yep. Um, but yeah, it's nice. Brilliant. And he's got an awesome purple shirt. Or is that blue? I mean, it's purple to me. I want a shirt like that. And you say he's cheesy. I know. <laughs> he doesn't have a fire wallet. So teeth he... are even the same whiteness of his jacket. I need, I need whiter teeth. Moving I on. feel inferior. Moving on. <laughs> let's move forward. Uh, let's go on to... Uh, well, first of all, we've given the price of that. You can get that down below. Let's move on to... Does it go on the worker's wall? Do you want it to? <laughs> um, I'm going to put this in the bottom one. It, it could be a uh, crowd pleaser. Yeah, let's put it in crowd pleaser um, because I think if you're going to... Be doing things like this it's very good for what you're doing so yeah great and uh crowd pleaser it is uh canic 
So Boom! It says, Organic Miracle with Borrowed Soda Can. Yep. Nicholas Lawrence. Can on it? The, on the back, it says, Borrow Any Can. <laughs> okay. Well, let's, we'll get into that. It's twenty three ninety nine, And uh, let's cut to a trailer of it now. No magic is harder than organic and situational miracles. Canic is an extremely practical piece of magic that'll dazzle your toughest audiences. Do you mind grabbing the can for me? Is it empty? Yeah. Perfect. Touch it, touch it. Yeah, touch it. Can borrow one of your hands? Oh, uh, this actually, yeah. Uh, okay. Check this out. Can you see the tap yet? So I don't know if this is gonna work though. Watch. You can see uh, it's back on. Whoa. <laughs> How do you hold this? Hold this, hold this. Can I feel it? Yeah, Can go I ahead. Feel it? Oh my god, it was off. Went back on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah, it's just touch. What? Touch. No way, it's back on. <laughs> what? <laughs> what it's happened? It's actually back on. Really? <laughs> Tell Kemba what happened. It's actually back on. I thought there was like a magnet or something, <laughs> but it's, it's like screwed back on. Once it's in your wallet, you'll always be ready to go. Whether you're trying to get a gig at a restaurant, impress your friends or colleagues in some social gatherings, or even defining the impossible with a soda can lying around at a press conference. Look no further. This is Canning. And we are back again! Okay, too much. Uh, yeah, Canic. Far too much. Um, you were saying about the front and the back. On a side note, I'm not going to go on a rank about uh, a rank? Uh, rank, a rant, a rant about uh, the word organic. As a chemist who's got a background ah. in chemistry, it's certainly not organic. We uh, hate organic. But, but, why did people use that word but, organic? But, but there we go. Um, right. Okay. You may have caught on the um, forums, other places. If you only watch this halfway through, you may go off on a certain tangent, thinking they've lied everywhere. Yep. Um, they do teach a method that is impromptu. That's all I'll say. And uh, is it right at the end? versions. Right, right at the end. As um, other reviewers found out at a certain <laughs> point. I wasn't saying that, <laughs> but I'll tell you, after watching it for the like, oh, best part of 40 minutes, but, I was sat there silently um, stewing, thinking, you beep, 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 yeah, beep, yeah. beep, and then it gets to the bit and you go, oh, okay, all is well. Yeah. So Nicholas Lawrence, I think they refer to him as their in-house artist, who yes. comes up with unboxing and a few of the other yep. ones. Very, very creative guy, obviously. The closest thing out there, Yep. is probably something like Prohibition, which is more beer bottle related. Yep. So what you, the effect is, if, in case you haven't picked it up, you could borrow a can. Yep. You could do this. You could borrow a can, empty it out. You could pull off the ring the pull, ring yeah. Oh. Have it in someone's hand and hit, and it, it goes back on and then you can hand it out. So you can mm. do that with this. And to be fair, I preferred the uh, non-gimmick version, the way, the, the clean version, than the non-clean version, than the setup version. Yeah, personally, so, so I, don't like, I, I don't think I, I wouldn't go with the first method. Uh, I think it's a li probably a little bit too contrived yeah. in how they've done it anyway. But if you're doing a magic special, yeah. that is the method of choice. Yeah. If you want to do it as we've just described, you can do it with this. This. I'd thing. much rather be clean. I'd rather use it's any can. Nice. Boom. And full marks to Herman for getting the word girth into this. I'm sure, I'm sure he talks about the girth of the can, and that's why they go for Red Bull cans. Really? Uh, and that, that is a, a great use. We, we, people don't use the word girth often enough in the English I language. I think they should try and get that into as many review shows as we can from now on, the girth. It's interesting, product. you'll start noticing some of the same people. They must have filmed this at the same time as some of the other ones, because yeah. it must uh, be easy to, to batch do it. But all, all magic it. shops do but, that. But, yeah. Um, it's, yeah, it's, it's very, very good. They did multiple live performances, um, and then the studio performance, well taught. Yep. Um, it Good does. DVD. It does what it says it will do. Is what I'll say. Again, yep. um, TV rights not included. I think that's a standard science yep. mind sort of thing now. Yep. But if you want to do the ring pull thing, the thing that I was thinking of that you might team this up with as another sort of impromptu thing to have in your box of tricks would be sinful. The old Wayne Houchin thing, where you can put a uh, 10p coin if you're over uh, this side, yep. and you can put it into the uh, can, open the can, 
and then pour out the drink and it's in, uh, you could then go into this. But it's probably too much to do both at the same time. Too much but having that, it in yeah. your arsenal would be quite useful. For, so, for so, sure. So that for might sure. be something for people to think about. So, uh, right, give it a rating. Your turn first this time. Um, well, first of all, how much is this one? This one is twenty three ninety nine. You can see the price here. You can get it from down below as well. And what would you rate this out of 10? If you don't already do Prohibition, and yep. you're not into the bar sort of scene where you might do Prohibition, yep. I think this is a go-to effect for, the, for that style. That doesn't give us an idea of, it of, the, of the rating. Um, I think it's good. I think probably in the 8 to 9 category. 8 to 9. So shall we go at 8.5 for this? Yeah. Boom. There we do. I've said boom twice now in this. Boom. Boom. Um, Canic. 20... Three ninety nine and it's eight point five out of ten. Um, does it go in the workers' war? Mm, I'm going to probably say we've got a lot in there at the moment. Not quite. Yeah, that's, that's fair. Yeah. It's, it's good effect. It's very good. I, I don't know if it's your go-to in part of your set, mm. but I think it's something different to have. It's like, to have to, really to capitalise on a moment. Yeah. So it might be the one that you do when you're. You're not doing your set. If you yep. wanted to just do a magic moment for someone, bang, yep. you could do it that way. Brilliant. Um, I think it could come in that way. Uh, just a, just sort of a note, if you were looking at this, or just from the box, I thought this was very similar to, or going to be very similar to Deceptus, and I thought it was a coin into the can. I thought, oh, yeah. hang on a minute. this Nothing like that. It's nothing no. like it. So no. don't make that sort of mistake. Yeah. This is separate. This is the ring pull. That's something different Ring pull, the yeah. tab, yeah. however you want to, to call it. Yeah. Um, you need to be prepared, so it's not the sinful type of impromptu, but yeah. if you're prepared, prepared in the way you need to be yep. you can be handed a can and do it that's yep. what i'll say exactly so you can get that from down below in the link so i'm james anthony this is daniel meadows ciao for now What? Oh, come on, man. If I get really more organised in how we set up these shows, can you come on every, at least every two weeks? I've got work to do. Uh, we'll and see, we'll see. So just just in case I did, education don't see me first. In case you don't see me for a while, uh, that's the reason. Uh, we oh. haven't fallen out, there's no secret uh, argument. Um, it's because you guys made I'm him studying. wear a pink shirt. Yeah, it is, it is. That's that is, why. That's the reason. And you've still not done your, your part of the bargain. It's coming um, soon. So I'm off to study, so if you don't see me much, that'll be why. Exactly. But we hope to have you on every now and again still, so we'll see. until afterwards. However, however, uh, we have reached 3,000 likes recently, uh, subscribers on Facebook, and uh, we've decided to do a very special competition video, but we're not doing it as part of this video. It's going to come in another video in the next few days' time, so you can look out for that on our channel. And this is another huge, huge giveaway. First, we gave away that box a few weeks back. Oh, is it even bigger than that? That huge box. It's just different, more expensive stuff, you know, more uh, professional to, to meet all, all you know, eight ranges and stuff. Got to be in it to win it. So, yeah, exactly. So, uh, tune in, get ready for the competition. Please click subscribe. It keeps us going and keeps us lively and uh, keeps us with a meal on our tables. Okay, it doesn't quite, does it? It pays nothing, really. <laughs> <laughs> but it's great. It gets nothing for him. You were complaining before because you didn't get a you didn't get a pink like Sam did. Yes, yeah, Sam, Sam got a free freebies right. last I'll time. I'll give you something free. Don't worry, it's you're about in. Five months I've been doing this. <laughs> <laughs> nothing, nothing. Damn it. Boom. Do it for Thank the month. you very much. Exactly. You do love magic, don't you? That's what it's all about. This week's show is sponsored by PrintbyMagic.com. We print directly to your bicycle playing cards.